Hey guys, welcome to my college haul. I'm going to try and make this as quick as possible just so that I'm not spending like an hour doing it. Like you're not having to watch an hour worth of someone shopping, what someone's bought and all that. Because I don't, I'd never do that. So yeah, um, I hope you enjoy. Okay, so first shop. This is actually the one I was most excited about. Um, I saw it on Instagram and I just thought I have to give it a try. The deal is just unmissable. There was some of the stuff in there I actually wanted to get from Amazon but was going to cost me an absolute fortune and I wasn't willing to pay. And then they were actually in and I could pick the colours I wanted which I was so happy about. Um, so I said to my mum, do you want anything? And she picked a couple of things as well. We ordered it and it arrived and I was like so happy. Um, but yeah, so one of the first things, document wallet, I absolutely love pastel, you will see that throughout the whole of this, that I am pastel themed, um, so I have two pink, four purple and four green, I'm not happy, I wish I had four pink and not four green, but it just means I can pick my two favourite subjects, my two, my four, yeah, middle of the road subjects I'm happy with, and my four... And my fault that I'm like, oh no, I don't want to do that. That's if I have ten. If not, I can have three that I'm like, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. <laughs> or I'm really struggling with those subjects, so they will go in there. They'll be the ones I'm no, I'm going to struggle in. So yeah, one of the things I got. Staples. You will see in a bit why I bought staples. I bought five hundred of these. I regret it, but hey ho, no not 500, 5,000, so it means I have enough staples now to last me a lifetime. Um, another thing, I'm just having to pick them all out. Permanent markers, I've never actually used these yet, as soon as I get my subject I will start using these because I will decorate each folder and all that. Um, I just think they're really good to have, permanent markers, and they're pastel coloured, so it's with my theme. Sorry, I have a little bag which is like here, which I'm tracking everything into. Um, I also got highlighters. Did you know your girl needs highlighters? Um, and you will notice I may have many highlighters um but yeah they're also pastel i just really think they're really cool um and i'm happy with them i'm just counting because these ones are things that are sets i have three sets of colored pens these were the things i wanted to pick up from amazon but there was no guarantee I would have got the colours I wanted or the colour I wanted because I was only going to pick up the one pack. And then seeing as they were a pound, I decided, you know what, why not just pick up all three packs? I just think they're so cute. Um, so as you can tell, I am kind of colour theming. I still can't mention that a couple of times. But yeah, um, they're like a pound for three of them, so... I got three purple, three blue, and three pink. If you buy from Amazon, you either get the three purple, the three blue, or the three pink. This website, I managed to get three of each for about the same price as just the three. So I was happy. Next, three pencils. I don't really use pencils, but I thought I'd pick them up so that I had some. Correction fluid. I always need correction fluid. Um, tissues. There was a pack of like, I think it was like 10 or something. Something stupid like that. I don't know where most of them have gone. <laughs> but yeah, so one of these will always be in my college bag just in case I need them. Um, and then there was this little set. There was a pencil that goes with the set, but I'm not actually quite sure where that pencil has gone. So it comes with a pen, a sharpener, a rubber, 
and a ruler. And then one other thing was, I think we had another uh, rubber and then another sharpener which went with the three pencils. Um, that is everything I got from that store. It was like a really, really big haul for me. Or at least that's everything I can get my hands on that I got from that store. Um, I might have got other bits and bobs. But I don't know. Yeah, but on to the next store. Okay, so my next shop is Penland. I do use Penland a lot just because they do have really good deals on everything. And as a student, I don't have much money, really. Um, that's what I know as students, really. At least being a student for the last three years, money wasn't always available. Um, I don't think I could live alone and be a student, like look after a house and be a student. I struggle just being a student. But yeah, I thought I'd show you everything that I bought from Penland. So, blue tech, if you need to put stuff up in your walls, for, for me and photography, I will be doing a lot of that. So I'll be writing up about each photo, probably on some revision cards. Um, so I'll put photos up and then I'll write about them as well. That's a really important thing, in my opinion. This is a must have, I know. Not necessarily to stay in your bag, but at least to have. I know everyone should have deodorant. This one was specifically bought, so I had one in my college bag. Um, and yeah this one is my college one specifically i don't use it any other time it is only used for if i need it whilst in college um this is one thing a lot of you might go well that's not necessarily that's not necessary for me it is washi tape um i use it to divide out what my what is my assignment? What is me actually working on my assignment? So what's the assignment brief? What is me actually working on it? And then that's it really right now. <laughs> um, but yeah, washi tape is a really good thing. I enjoy having my washi tape. I think it's awesome to have. Um, you know, a pound for like nine of them, I think it was. No, a pound for six isn't bad, so I actually bought three packs. Two packs that are the same, which is... Four, five, six. So I got two packs like that. You can kind of see them all. There we go. So two packs that have those ones in. And then one pack. Of the Valentine's ones, but I just think the Valentine ones are just cute, so you know that's why I grab them. They're actually quite a recent buy, though. Um, next is pens. These are for if any other students need a pen. That's why I mainly bought them. I have all of these that they can use, um, and they're actually decent pens, it's just I don't want to give out my really, really nice ones. Not just yet anyway, especially during the pandemic. Um, then, I got three zebra pens, these were a pack and then I think I got a pack of three of these but I don't know where the other two have gone, which is sad, I don't know. But yeah, I've got lots of zebra pens, um, as you already assumed. I really enjoy zebra. It's really nice and smooth. The ink is really good. And yeah, I absolutely adore zebra pens. Um, next. Double A batteries. Being on a photography course, I need batteries. They were two pounds for a pack of 30. So... I went and picked up a pack of AA 
to my pack was triple A. Um, I have a lot of things that need batteries, so. I don't have many that need triple A, but I do have a lot that need double A. So, and hey, okay, usually I call them. Usually I call double A A4 for some reason. I just want to point that out. But yeah, so I have 30 of each. They're in a box right now because I haven't needed them, but I will be putting batteries in everything that uses them now. So that's going to be fun to do. And I dropped one. Great. <laughs> um, next is just a little lunchbox. It's insulated. I just think it's really cool. I don't need to use it right now just because we are not in during lunch because of the pandemic. The college is keeping us in right now just for three and a half hours. Um, but then once we are back full time, I will have a nice cute lunchbox, which is marble. I thought it was really good. A little to-do pad. Sorry, I remembered the a little to-do pad, um, I'm going to start using this a little bit more now because hopefully we go into our different subjects and knowing what I need to do for each subject is going to be a little bit easier than beforehand because I was only doing one subject before now and next I think I'll be doing nine. So yeah, I'll be at least doing a few. We haven't actually been told what subjects we're doing and I can't wait to find out what the actual subjects are that we will be doing from hopefully October. Um, but yeah, and lastly, if I can untangle them so they don't look a giant mess. Give me a minute. Uh, untangled. As my phone's just like, low battery! <laughs> yes! Hit your little battery, I've been recording on you for the last hour. You know what, they're gonna have to just stay kind of tangled. It's just the top bit. Wired headphones, they're just an emergency pa pair of headphones if I ever need them. Because, you know. I just sit on the bus now. I take the bus. I never used to take the bus. Music is my savior. But, yeah. That is everything that I got from Poundland. On to the next shop. Okay, I forgot to mention one other thing um, my mum got me from Poundland. Gloves, they are the touch ones so that I can still use my phone even whilst wearing gloves. The reason she's got me these is because it is getting cold and usually my mum likes to message me on my way home. As I'm walking and yeah she thought it'd be nice just to get me a pair of gloves that means I can use my phone okay b and I'm quite happy with all the stuff I got from B&M um, don't use there's only like one thing well a couple of things I use daily so bulldog clips they was called fold back fold back clips. Got a little tub of these. They're pink. They're cute. They're just tiny, which I'm happy with. Um, just if I want something a bit sturdier than a paper clip, I have them. This is right now my first aid kit. Um, so it has my painkillers, my plasters, and my alcohol wipes. Um, my mum always taught me keep a first aid kit on you just in case so that's why I have that and my old one which works in my rucksack does not work in my handbag my handbag has just got too much stuff whereas my rucksack didn't have as much stuff my handbag needs a little bit more stuff than my rucksack did so yeah I have a smaller first aid kit, but it has everything that I need in it. Next up is a little mirror. A for Artina Pan I'm going with. You know, it's not actually. Ta-da! There's you guys. Um, it's very cute. I love it. 
it just lives in my bag. I don't actually use it every day. I, I haven't actually used it whilst at college, but it's there if I need it. Which I think is awesome. Post-it notes, one of these days I'm going to need them. Uh, so I just got them just in case. It's me. I'm terrible with stuff like that. Yeah. And then lastly, coloured pens. I was sceptical on buying these to start with and then I just kind of thought to myself I want to colour code things and having coloured pens would be easier than highlighting everything. Um, so, yeah. Mainly because for one of my assignments right now I am colour coding it and I'm not highlighting massive bits. So yeah, that is everything that I got from B&M. On to the next. Okay, so the next store is in fact Boots. I have actually bought quite a bit from Boots, as you can tell over the last wee while. Um, the Boots sale has done me well. Just want to point that out. But yeah, I thought I would just mention everything that I got from Boots. So yeah, first thing I want to show you, I have shown some of these. I picked up body sprays. Um, they are specifically for college. I can use them outside of college, but I bought them mainly so I can have college ones for in college. I do need one more and then I have the set, which is what I'm wanting. I have the set of the big ones. Yay. I've got one that's up there and then the rest of them are in a box under my desk right now. So I just need one more little one and then I have the set of littles as well. I am going to be working on getting the set of everything. So I have everything from it, each set, but I'm going to slowly build that up. Um, I'm about to sneeze. <laughs> no, I'm not. Um, wet wipes. They're like antibacterial ones, um, which for right now is really good. Because, you know, if I don't want to use hand sanitizer, I have got hand wipes. Um, and they're good for sensitive skin. Which I think is really, really good. Um, kills 99.9% .9 of bacteria. I think that's pretty good. Lastly, I'm going to show you them all and I'm actually going to tell you the name of each shade. I would have already mentioned two of these, maybe three of them, and then some of them I will be mentioning in this week's vlog because I bought them and they arrived yesterday. So, I'm going to show you that side. So you can kind of see all the colours. And I'm going to show you them one by one. So this is the lightest. This is Faith. Annoyingly, I don't know where my ring light is. Because having my ring light right now would be really good. So, yeah. Then there's this one. This is Captive. I've got this one. This is Inspire. I'm trying to go in like colour order. So like light to dark, but I kind of failed. This one, which is Victory. My mum has one of them too. She wanted one. This one is one I've apparently had. I don't remember having this one beforehand and the seal is broken. I don't know. I'm gonna have to ask. No, because my mum hasn't even seen these yet. I might have to do something. I don't know. But this is Freedom. Should be fine. I think I opened this one. Let's look at the colour. They wouldn't have sent me one that was open, so. Alright, this is Freedom. I think it's really cute. This one 
is Courage. It's a bit more purpley than you can tell, so it looks quite red on camera. It's not. It's kind of a purpley colour. So that's Courage. This one is, that is kind of the colour it's showing, is Conquer. I swear I haven't opened these and they are un they are already open, so I'm actually going to contact Boots and say two of them are open already and I know I haven't opened them yet. I'm going to send them photos. I'm just like, I know for a fact I didn't open them. Because that is two of them. I haven't opened any of my new ones. Oh wait, that one might not be a new one. Might only be the one, so I might just leave it. Because I thought this was one of my old ones, but it's not. This is a new one. But this is... Fearless. I'm going to go on my Boots app though and see which ones I ordered um, and then yeah have a wee I think because I might have opened the one but I definitely didn't open two all the others are sealed so. but yeah that is everything I got from Boots though. What's next? Okay, so home bargains. My mum bought me most of this. Um, I mean, I wasn't, I'm not complaining. I'm happy. I love it all. But yeah, so a little. I don't even know what it's called. I think it's like a document wallet thing. Document folder, I'm going to call it. Oh, it's a box file. That's what it says. Um, we just opened that like that. She also got me a weekly planner. As soon as I get my full timetable, I will be putting it up on there and then I can decide what days will be specifically for studying after college and then what days I will be doing vlog stuff and then what days I will be doing other bits of the vlogs just kind of finding a way to fan out my weeks she also got me a matching folder because you know my cat has now decided to attack my door she has an hour and 20 minutes until dinner time I've been doing this for over an hour now. I'm kind of exhausted, but I've got a couple more jobs to do, so yeah. Um, also, I want to point out I'm not recording this in order. Um, so, even on this, there's like, so right now for you guys, there's four more shops left. For me, I think there's only like two, one or two shops left for recording. Maybe three, I can't remember. But yeah, next was a little kit. Stapler, stapler remover and hole punch as well as staples. As I mentioned in the first shop I bought 5,000 staples. Um, this is the other thousand so I now have 6,000. Lastly, sticky labels. They are actually like labels. Um, let's see if I can get one. For me, these are really good just because I do like to label everything. So, they're just like that. And they come in a box which has a dispenser, which I think is pretty cool. So, yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, what's the word? Strengthen one of these boxes and then it will be my permanent dispenser because I know I can pick them up for a decent price and all I need to do is put the new roll in but yeah so I picked up three packs of that um yeah that is everything from home bargains I didn't really buy much from home bargains so yes on to the next okay next is Tesco. So first I'm going to show you the stuff I picked up before college and then there's one actual thing that I picked up recently which is technically for college but it's for a different reason. And then there's one thing that's really old which is just my tape. Um, 
I used to get the kit which used to give me pretty much everything in and it used to call it student essential kit um, so it used to come with tape, glue sticks, pair of scissors, um, a ruler, a notebook, a folder and then some dividers I didn't want to get that this year I think I've done it three years in a row and I wasn't a fan of doing it again um, just because I wasn't actually a really big fan of the notebooks because they fell apart, apart like midway through using them and it just got on my nerves so yeah I had a roll of tape that I hadn't quite finished from that pack but yeah now onto the other stuff that I bought there was this one kit that I bought I did actually buy a kit which if I just grab everything from the kit besides from one thing because I don't know where it is okay that's not okay so there is one more thing to this kit but I can't actually see where I put it trust me but yeah so this kit if I show you this that is the kit folder, comes with four highlighters, I don't know where I put the other highlighter though, really cute pen, I love this pen, it's so cute, I haven't actually used it yet but I think it's adorable, you've seen the folder, it comes with revision cards, there is more than that, it's just they're in use right now, um, I have a lot of revision cards, I just want to warn you that, um, yeah, and so it comes with revision cards. It came with a little poly pocket thing, but the poly pocket kind of broke, so I'm not actually using it. I don't know what I'm going to use it for. And it came with a study book. I haven't quite decided what I'm going to use this for either. But I do think it is really cute. But yeah, so that was that kit. That's some of the things I bought. Another thing I bought, I'm going to grab them all. Zebra pens, I adore my zebra pens. Um, it was a nice kit. There was more to this kit, but I don't know what most of it is. I'm not very good at a lot of the stuff I have misplaced, so. <laughs> highlighters! I have a lot of highlighters as well, as you guys could probably tell. Um, they're all pastel. They're not really actual pastel when I highlight but that's fine so that's everything that I bought before college and then this and it looks like for college mainly this I bought like a couple of weeks maybe last weekend the weekend before um just a little notebook it's got so much paper in it this is going to be my portfolio I don't want a normal portfolio, I don't want it in a scrapbook, I don't want it in a photo album. I'm thinking that and then I can put as much information as I need for each photo. Probably going to change my mind in about a week, but I'm going to stick with it for now. But yeah, that is everything from Tesco. I didn't really buy much from Tesco, I mainly did like Amazon and that this year, which you will see. But yeah, on to the next store. Okay, next shop is. I don't really know what to call it because it's lots of different shops. It's a couple. Um, it's just like off bits and bobs. So, first is these. I got them from Tiger. I think they were like a pound. But they're just little post-it notes, which I think were really cute. And yeah, I have them. Um, next, my phone just messages us. Um, is this? It's like a little pencil case, but I actually have the bag that goes with it. This was, my mum bought it for college, it doesn't actually come to college with me, but I just thought it was really good. It has been, it did on Wednesday last week, but that was only because it held stuff in it that I needed. It probably will not be in college with me every week, though. But I thought it was a really cute thing and I still wanted to show off. 
next power bank I have two one was from Amazon which I forgot to, which I'm gonna mention this now I forgot to mention in the Amazon one even though you guys see the Amazon one next I forgot to mention it I do have another power bank um, that I forgot to mention but this is my mum's spare one that she has given me so I have a spare one in my college bag got three bars I haven't needed to use it yet three notebooks so first one says I believe and achieve next one just says dream notes with a dream catch and this one says think happy thoughts these were all from the works um, we did a bit of a works the works order because my mum wanted a pin board like I have um, and then we found out it was better for her to get it from the works and she also wanted a whiteboard which was also better to get it from the works so we ordered from there more post-it notes um, these I think were from card factory these are mainly going to be used once my room is completely done because um, they will live on my desk I just thought they were really cute and I couldn't resist and yeah that is everything so I will see you in the next shop hey guys so this is store number eight which is Amazon I absolutely adore using Amazon um, I do buy a lot of stuff from there so yeah first thing I'm going to show you is my reusable straw it's a silicone one for if you're out and about you don't like the paper straws and Mackies or you just want to have a straw in something if you're someone who is out and about a lot and does it or if you're a student I do recommend the silicone if you're doing it at home and you know you're just going to be sat down doing nothing while using it I do I am fine well I do suggest the metal or the silicone we have metal ones in our house that me and my mum have um, me and my mum also have a silicone one each so yeah and the reason we picked up the silicone is because I wanted one and it was a pack of two so my mum said she'd have one too but yeah if you're a student or you're out and about a lot whilst you're drinking I do suggest silicone but if you're not metal is fine um, reduce the plastic so which is why we have them um, next my laptop bag um, it's pastel pink because my colour theme for college is pastel um, yeah as you can tell because I'm sure you guys have seen like my bag and you have seen bits and bobs but you haven't seen all of it um, it does come with a little pouch but I have misplaced that I will be using this a lot next month though for a event that me and my mum do but yeah next this is a student must have it is a diary so you can write down so for me let me just do that's one of my weeks I have an assignment that was due that week I did get it in I think yeah I got it in I have something that is due on Monday which I need to put in um, I also put in when I started my half term but yeah this is really important the quote in it and I'm not saying who it's by just because when I say it I feel like I'm saying it wrong and the way I'm saying it makes it sound really inappropriate I'm not trying to copyright the quote though I'm admitting I'm I didn't make the quote, it is a quote that is in this book, but I don't know how to pronounce it and I'm not comfortable saying it on my YouTube channel. Okay? Um, so the quote is, the man who has confidence in himself gains the confidence of others. It should be the person who has confidence in themselves, but I'm fine with the man. It's his quote. It's probably a really old quote, because I know there was a quote in here from August, which I will also read because... It is a very important quote to me and the quote that I know is a really old one pretty much but it's really close to me is it's not 
the strongest species that survived, nor the most intelligent, but the most responsive to change. That gave me luck because I actually got my GCSE results the week that was the quote, and I passed it. But yeah, that was August, and then the man one was this week's. But yeah, so it's quote every week. Um, I don't know how they've managed to find 52 quotes, but the next next week's one is by Albert Einstein, though. But yeah, so my mum got me that off Amazon. We love the colours of it, and it was just kind of important for us. This is really an everyone must have, in my opinion. It's a purse. And then it's got my coins and everything in. Yes, I was coming up my provisional. I do have a provisional license. I haven't started driving yet though, but I have the license. More of a, more of a like ID sort of thing. Just because I've, I'm out, I do want ID and I don't want to have to worry about carrying around a passport. That was the only other form of ID I could think of. But yeah, so my mum got me that purse. Um, because apparently it's bad luck to buy your own purse and then when someone buys you a purse they're meant to give you a pound my mum couldn't find a pound so she was like really worried that I was going to have bad luck so she gave me a Simpson press coin which is still in my purse to this day <laughs> I mean I've only had it like two months but still um, yeah next is memory stick this is 32 gigabytes i will be using it for my portfolio so all my portfolio photos will be on there all my write-ups about my portfolio photos will be on there and if i do start to sell photos all that sort of stuff will be on there too they will be also backed up but having it on a memory stick i think will be good because it means if i want to access it and i don't have internet I can but yeah that is what I'm gonna use this for just because we don't actually need it our teacher keeps telling us to use OneDrive I'm waiting for him to turn around to me and say you've used up all your OneDrive already Wow I'm like yeah I save everything to OneDrive because I did um, I do need to go through it because I do have a couple of things that don't need to be on there anymore but yeah I got that Ow. I've got my pencil case, it is full of like pens and that, just because I couldn't be bothered to empty them out right now. But yeah, that is my pencil case. It's kind of heavy, it's not light. Um, I'm really happy with it. There was another one I was going to get, but I'm really happy I got this one because it goes with my theme so well. My theme, no, is not pink, it's pastel. Yes, this doesn't really look pastel, but to me it does, and I just think it's awesome, and it has so much storage in it, it's unreal. It's got a pouch there, which is my main pouch, that's got all my highlighters and that in, and then that has just my electrical stuff in. What else? This is a Me Essential for my course. One bit of it you could use if you have another bit of kit that I also have, but it's not really an essential batteries these are rechargeable because i'm on a photography course we use cameras most cameras are battery based my one is double a batteries four of them i now have 12 double a batteries just for my camera i will be picking up more because i do have other bits and bobs that use double a batteries that i do want to have as rechargeable because it saves the environment and it means I'm buying less batteries, so it's actually cheaper in the long run too. But, yeah, and then this kit also came with a charger. And I actually quite like this charger, because it's not straight plug into the plug. It is got a cable. So it means when I do have my room set up, I can just stick this on my wall or something. I don't have to have it on my desk. And it's not, I can have my plug hidden out of the way and I can still get to this. Which was one of my main concerns for rearranging and redoing my room was what's going to happen with my um, battery charger but yeah there is four AAAs as well but two of them are in something right now what shows here next let me show these 
I'll show one. I have six packs of these, four unopened, two opened and started to use. They are actually really good. To start with, they were bought for me for the event that I'm doing next month. Now I'm actually using them for assignments. And they're not that expensive, so that's why I was fine buying so many. If they were a couple of quid each, I probably wouldn't have bought so many. But they're not even a quid each. So, yeah, I have a lot. These will be going into a storage thing now, just because it kind of needs done. I just don't know what yet. may not put them all in. I have an idea of which one. I just don't know if they'll fit in there. Fingers crossed. If they do fit in there, they'll be going in something. They won't probably all fit in there, but I'll get as much in there as I can. If it means they are put away somewhere safe that I can find. Bluetooth keyboard. I adore it. I don't use it too often, but I do absolutely love having it, and it is really helpful for me at times. But yeah, that's one of the things I got. And that uses AAA batteries. And that's, But that's not the thing the AAA batteries are in right now. They're actually in our, a medical thing that we use. Um, but that's something else that's not important. Okay, last few things which are kind of the same. Three A5 notebooks. Um... These are from Oxford, so the brand Oxford campus notebooks. Um, I'll show you the purple one because I haven't actually written in the purple one. As you can see, they've got little markers. You can download an app with these and you can save everything onto your phone. And then you can get it on any device that you are logged in on. I think you can only be logged in on two devices though, but I absolutely adore it. And at some point, this, in like a couple of days I'm going to be taking everything out of my college notebook and putting it in a folder but and out of the little one I use as well because I use pink for college I also got their refill pads these are A4 I've got three of them so that's like six notebooks as is and these I'm saying now aren't technically cheap notebooks those were like £9 each, same as these, I think. And then, lastly, I have six. I'm not even going to hold them all up. <laughs> Let's hold the green one up. I have six A4 with the spirals. Some of these were 12 some of these were £9 for the for three. So... I got a pack of three for like nine pounds something and then I got a pack of three for twelve. So I have three green, no, two green, two purple, two pink. I'm using the pink one for college. Yeah. But you know. You can that's a lot. One of them is also for the event that I'm doing next month. But yeah, that is everything from Amazon. Okay, I also forgot to mention this. I got Bluetooth headphones from Amazon. Um, they were on the Prime Day sale, sale, not sale, <laughs> sale. Um, and a lot of people might go, why Bluetooth headphones? Why not just get wired ones? They're cheaper. Some people might say they're more reliable. I always, I tried to have normal ones for the whole of the term. I hated it because they just got in the way most of the time or they tangle up very easily these don't do that and I'm very good at keeping them charged the only reason they wouldn't be reliable is if I couldn't charge them also there are some phones where if you want to charge the phone as well as listen to music you have to have an adapter whereas if you have bluetooth headphones it's a lot easier but yeah I forgot to mention I got that from Amazon Primark, the one that I was actually really excited about. Um, this is the last store. Um, and then I will show you what is in what will be in my college bag daily. 
it's a bit different than what I originally planned but I'm not in full time right now so when I am in full time I will do another video of my full time college bag but this is my part time college bag if that makes sense um I'm only in a couple of hours three times a week whereas hopefully I will be in for a little bit longer three times a week they're gonna be the same days I'm just not a fan that I'm only in three and a half hours um my cat is still roaring I literally recorded number five and then I'm doing this one so yeah first thing I'm going to show you my little rose gold kit I call it so I have rose gold paper clip rose gold pins and then rose gold goldy clips bulldog clips whatever you want to call them I absolutely adored this set I just thought it was really cute and I had to pick it up. Um, I'm rose gold obsessed. These are my emergency face masks. I have not had to open them yet. There are three in there. So they are if I forget my face mask, I can still get on the bus. This is like a little uh, bag organiser. I absolutely adore having it. Um, just because I can put a lot of stuff in it. And it's not massive and it does go with my theme. And then lastly is my bag. That keyring is not from Private Mark. That is actually from Birdland. But I needed something to show myself that I am still an animal girl. And my favourite owl is a barn owl. They didn't have barn owls, but I do love the snowy owls as well. So that's why I have a snowy owl. I also have it as a pin. But I haven't put the pin on the back. But yeah, that is everything from Primark. I didn't really get much. Oh no, there is more. There is more. I just remembered. Bulldog clips. They're not called bulldog clips. Bobby pins, they are an essential. I just want to point out my cat does get love and attention. She's just being difficult right now. As soon as I've recorded this, I am going to go check on her and see what she wants. Hairbands, there are more than this. I need to find my lower pile, but I had a load in here before. But yeah, that is everything from Primark. I'm about to go check on her so she doesn't hurt herself. And yeah, I will see you once I'm doing what's in my bag. Okay, so here is a part-time student, I'm calling it. Even though I'm on a full-time course, this is my part-time lessons bag. So, in my little um, bag organizer, in the big pouch, I am going to be putting, if I can grab them, all my coloured pen. Actually, no. They will not go in there. I'll decide where they go in a bit. First thing is going in is my mask. I just found something I've been looking for for a while. That can go in there for now. So yeah, first things in there will be my mask. They just go in that little pouch there. And my diary will also live in there. Now in the actual bigger pouch bit is going to be my three body sprays, my two lipsticks. I picked Faith and Captive. I worked out that they didn't send me an open one. I actually didn't order that one. That's an old one that I had. But yeah, my wipes. Um, my four washi tapes, because I'm only bringing four. My spare power bank. Um, my tissues, and then my normal tape. They will all live in there, on in that big bit. In the sides, um, so in the side that's closest to me, I'm going to have my card reader. I just like to bring it with me just in case. 
and then my mirror and then just a pack of mentals yes they're open I can't remember how long they last whilst open it doesn't say so it should be fine and then on the side away from me it goes my hairband and then my bobby pins they live in there and then each side pocket one is going to have my ruler and then if I can grab them all all of my coloured pens they are going in one side and then in the other is going my important information cards because they go in there and in the big pouch also goes my moisturiser because that lives in there and then this whole bag just goes in to my big bag with my pencil case which has all my other pens, pencils and everything else that I need in there already. Also in there is going my gloves. I have a little side pocket just on the inside. My first aid kit just slides in there. These actually live in part of my pencil case, if I just pull my pencil case back out, these actually live in here, they just slot in like that, and then my pencil case slots in there, then I have a little box of snacks, that lives in there, and so does my purse. And then at the side, my big notebook, and then my little notebook, as well as my portfolio, they live at the side, as soon as it's all done I will show you as well. I have a pile of photos, they, as long as they fit, no, so my purse will actually live on top, and my photos will go by my snacks. And then a decent amount of cue cards. So some of these are already used. These ones are already used. These are plain. They all go in as well by my revision cards. I think that is everything. Because that is that's actually not my one. So I will show you what it looks right, like. That is what it looks like. So I've got my revision cards and my photos and then my snack box, my two notebooks, my purse. I've got my little notebook there, my pencil key, and everything like that. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. Bye!